Good morning, everybody. This is Dylan with Espresso Outlet, and today we are going to be doing an unboxing on the new Turin 40 millimeter hand grinder. Uh, this is the H40. So if you guys are uh, new into pour overs or you are familiar with pour overs and you really want a really nice hand grinder uh, for that, uh, this is definitely a great option as well, and you can't beat the price. Uh, also, if you're looking into doing espresso, uh, it does adjust for both espresso all the way to pour over. So uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and get unboxing. All right, so let's just go ahead and read the front. It says more ergonomic handle length for energy saving food grade stainless steel burr. It's got a seven core minimal design. Uh, it does have the Turin uh, logo right on the front there. And when we turn it to the side, uh, like I said, you can go fine and coarse. So coarse grinding, medium grinding, and fine grinding, it does it all. Uh, so what that means is from coarse, medium, and fine, you can do French press, pour over, drip coffee, siphon, all the way to espresso. That's stainless steel 420 burr, minimal design, consistent grinding. It is very portable because it's small and then it's labor saving and easy to clean, which is going to be important. So let's go ahead and get this unboxed. All right, so same thing here. This is the H40 grinder. And if you look here, it says if you go, how to adjust the grind size. So rotate the adjust nut anti-clockwise for zeroing to your grind size. So here it just shows you the build of how the grinder is made. So it shows you have your ball, you have your bearing, your handle, the lid, the U-clip, other bearing, bearing cover, all the way down to the receiver. All right, so here is the hand grinder. This is the H40. Uh, like I said, it's got the logo right here, the Turin. So you're going to notice that there's all these little fine adjustment knobs here. So the more that those knobs get covered up, so I'll just remember it's right around 10. The more those knobs get covered up like so, the coarser you're gonna be going. But you have to make sure that when you adjust this knob, you don't just adjust it and that's it. Especially when you're grinding coffee, you have to make sure that you have the knob or the handle and you're going to be spinning it as you go. This grinder has a really nice feel to it. It's easy to adjust. Um, it comes with this nice wooden handle and it just clicks right on top here and it goes. It's super easy. It's very smooth. Uh, down at the bottom you have your catch cup. This is where all of your coffee is going to go into and this is where all the coffee is going to come out of from the burrs. So to screw that back on you just go counterclockwise. And there is a disc right here that actually screws clockwise off. And that's to get to inside the burrs for when you clean, which will be another video that I will show later on. Um, but let's go ahead and show you guys the rest of the stuff that comes with this hand grinder. So included is a little tiny brush, which is nice, especially when you're cleaning and to get the rest of the grinds off of the catch cup uh, in between different beans or whichever. And then here they, they give you this little tiny cup just so you can dose your coffee into the hand grinder so you're not trying to do it all with your hands scoop it in and then place it I would recommend setting this on a scale tearing it and then adding your beans so you know exactly how much grind you're putting into the actual hand grinder itself or obviously do like a single dose option like this and then you can just dump that in so yeah really nice looking uh, I'm gonna go ahead and take some pictures and include it in this video and you guys can see uh, what exactly the H40 looks like and what it's about. Stay tuned for grinding and dialing this grinder in for espresso with the Lillette Bianca coming soon.